Hey guys, and what you just saw was kind of my desk slash gaming setup before I cleaned it up. And I cleaned it up because it was needed a lot. It was really needed. So, I did that, and I kind of wanted to show you my gaming setup and how I game if you guys watch me or if you don't. So, I'm going to kind of get into this. I kind of moved some stuff out of the way. And I'm just going to sit down real quick. And this is kind of how I see it. I usually have this pulled out and these are a couple notebooks one this one here is where I have some drawings um, just the buildings there's the foundations and I usually put stuff like that and this is a good one sorry about this because it's on my iPad oh crap it's on my iPad and it's kinda hard to hold but if you can see like all the number autofocus all the numbers I plan it out and this is if you watch my series this is the community center and this is the bakery I just have them planned out and stuff like that and then this one's from the or spawn mod just like I plan them out usually and they usually draw with sharpies but that's just that's nothing and right here is kinda I don't know how to say this it's like the video notes I would say it's just notes that I've written down of how a video like the ideas I have for it and stuff like that and then on my desk you can see like I cleaned it up it looks fairly nice like there's my lava lamp which is a thing that I have on when I'm recording just like stuff like that there's a sign that I'm gonna pin up right about there soon um, these cube things are is something that I used to play with and then this Rubik's Cube which I can actually solve but I'm not going to because I think they look better when you don't just like some flashlights a news article from when my baseball team won a tournament that we were hosting so it was kind of weird that we won our own tournament but you know and then a sticker from that skateboard right there you can't really see it but it it's snowy so it's not written much just like for, something out of a fortune cookie but I thought it was a really nice saying so I, I went ahead and put it in my desk and then there's like a picture of Danica Patrick cause I mean why not and then Alex Rodriguez who is my favorite baseball player but I don't really watch baseball, and then Peyton Manning, who, I mean, led our team to a lot of victories, even though he only won a couple of Super Bowls, and then, like, my mouse and a Turtle Beach sticker, and then, like, pictures that my grandma sent me, and there's me golfing, and then there's a nice older man that I met while I was playing golfing. There's my turkey call. I do it, but it, it gets really loud, like a globe, which I usually have on the United States, and my easy button, if I can click it. That was easy. Yeah. Uh, those notes, I usually just write stuff on like that, but those are just like little notes, and then like a place where I can put all my pens, like markers that I use and whatnot. So I guess you guys probably want to see the computer. So I will be back in just a minute and you'll see that. Okay guys, here it is. Here's my computer with a custom background that I've made. I make all the thumbnails and stuff. As you can see here, if I can click on it with my iPad slipping out of my hands. But like this one, I make all of these on a website that's online and it's free called pixlar.com. It's really, it's really nice. It's really helpful because I can go on there and make all of them. Like I made this little background screensaver, and I really like it. Uh, I did just do this today, so I'm kind of getting used to it. But the CreatureCraft is the name of my online server, as you can see, like the best server Minecraft has ever seen. Like just stuff like that. You can do creative things on there change the fonts so there we go and then for the computer it is a four-year-old laptop 
that has an Intel Core 2 processor with Windows Vista and I mean I, I run like a few programs down there as you can always see but here would be my recording software if it pulls up it's called Snagit and there's a Snagit editor and it's really useful it is a, quite a big program so it does kinda slow down your computer as you can see down here like here's all my minecraft stuff if i can get over there um... just like my minecraft obviously and then the the videos these are the rough videos just stuff in there you can see snag it just the rough stuff that hasn't been edited yet so and then like skins and mods and you know all that the forge it's what is needed to run most of the mods that I do so let me kind of show you around um, above my desk is like a Ford emblem and Cadillac emblem like not that I favor those two more it's just what I have and then one of the most important things in the process I have is the flash drive this is what I save everything on so I have a backup of it I mean nothing everything's replaceable now just like a corner of junk and like hats and trophies from like f past things and like more trophies and like there's my TV and there's like my lizard I have a leopard gecko just like she chilling in there if I can like get a there you can, you can kind of see her in there but yeah and then my zombie head piggy bank that I made and like just a bunch of crap and like animals and stuff that probably should have got I should have gotten rid of a long time ago and then like there's my xbox and I have all my gaming stuff and my turtle beaches over there don't mind the tv it's just what, on whatever and then like bookshelves that has a have a lot of stuff in them. There's stuff that isn't really relevant or important. Um, drawers full of junk, uh, fishing lures, cards, just a bunch of random stuff. Things that could be thrown away and probably should be thrown away, but I haven't. So, you know. And I don't know what the heck just happened. Like, I have no idea, but, yeah, it's pretty much, what the heck, it's a weird tent, um, so yeah, that's basically about it, like, um, just like, quick little room tour, like, stuff like that, like, pillow pad that my grandma got me in my Xbox, and, Actually, my headphones that are broken, but whatever. They're like $40, so it doesn't matter. Uh, so, thank you guys for watching. Uh, this has been a fairly short episode with a very shaky hand on my iPad. And, like, a weird... Yeah, see, it keeps doing it. I don't know what it, why it's doing that, but it's, like, making my room a weird, weird color, so... Before I go, I'm going to kind of show you what I see when I'm recording, and then I'm going to get up, get out of your hair. But I guess real quick, I'll tell you about the fan under my computer. It's like, it's basically normal. Most people have a fan under their laptop to keep it cool, so they don't have to worry about things overheating. But yeah, I had to tie the cords up because usually it... It's like scattered everywhere and it annoys me. But if you can see that, my computer is always charging because if it's not, it will die. I don't know why, because I got this from my mom. And she, I mean, I didn't get, I heard about all the things that were wrong with it, but I didn't like really listen. So, yeah. Uh, I'll see you guys back here to show you kind of what I see so see you in a minute okay guys this is usually what I see like I only have that light on like I said 
and like usually my TV's running and all that and the fan emits a blue light on the side if you can see usually I have to unplug it when I want to um, upload something or something when I want to save on my flash drive because it's in the same port but yeah I can't really see anything but that's okay because I just sit here like in game but I guess Thank you guys for tuning in. I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, do all the things that make you guys so wonderful. And I just wanted to let you know that I was glad to make this Ultimate Gaming Setup video. So, thank you and bye. <laughs>